Sometimes it's hard to realize when you found a special place. Sometimes it's not. When our feet first stepped on damp ground into a forest that smelled like perfumes of moss and trees and sunshine and light, the way we walked changed. The steps we took became no broader nor shorter, the speed of our pace didn't change, but instead the weight of our steps. Trudging through muck became privilege instead of punishment, pulling up weeds and feeling dirt under our nails became something more than required and more than school and more than work and more than obligation. Using our bodies to accomplish and to live and to create and to nurture wasn't optional anymore. I think that's when we knew this place was something more than ordinary. I think that's when we knew this place was somewhere different. You can see it in the way the teacher's eyes light up when they take us outside. You can see it in the way our mentors smile, not at a day without rain, but at a day with lots to see. You can see it in the way our words jump off of each other, and the way connections are made like honey dissolves into tea. You can see it in the way the clicks of our heels take up without a pause, and the way the corner of one smile turns into the corner of the next, and how one side of all of our faces got sunburned on the same day, and none of us noticed. You can see it in the way we sometimes hold things that are a bit too heavy and show off the soreness of our backs because we're proud of what we've done. You can see it in the way that when one of us hurts, we all hurt, and that when one of us has a good day, we laugh together. Even if it's over the little things, like how you named your hammock something weird, or how that package you got looked more like a boiled potato than a box, or how you had an encounter with a flying squirrel that ended in friendship. <laughs> you can see it in the way that more often than not, our whispers turn into talking that turns into screaming and shouting and exclamations, and suddenly it gets so loud that we don't even know who's talking anymore. I knew this place was somewhere more than ordinary, and when not knowing who was talking, I felt special. I knew this place was somewhere more than ordinary, when hearing a chorus of voices where my own used to be felt like privilege. Where we crawl together, we walk together, we march together, we stomp together. Where we used to look at our own feet, we now look at our footprints. And this time it means something. This time, we know what we're doing. And we know what we're doing together. This time we know that we are not just ordinary. This time, we let ourselves come together. This time, we fell in love with our steps.